Nine-year-old Kieran Clausen collects crystals. She dabbles in face paint and she loves sports. What do you play? I did play volleyball, soccer, and I want to play basketball. To Kieran, who's transgender, it's not about racking up victories. I don't want to win any trophies for it, though. I feel like that's the most most unfair way to compete because it's not about winning. What's it about? Having fun with your friends. So we're really just going to pretend like the mom isn't telling her exactly what to say. We all know the interviewer sees it, but it's continuing to go along anyway. That's all these reporters do. That's all anybody does in the mainstream is just go along with whatever victim is playing the role. And she's absolutely playing the victim to be on TV. That's the only reason why you would rehearse those lines to be on TV is if you wanted attention and you wanted to spread a message out there and be looked at as a hero. And that's what a lot of these parents do. The ones that force their kids into this stuff is the ones that want to be the heroes. It's tough. It's hard to um, do everything that you can to support your child and then have, uh, yeah. and then have lawmakers come in who don't know anything and say that you're doing the wrong thing for your child. It's just, it's really hard. It, it's very personal. The lawmakers are attacking one of the smallest minorities that we have. Title IX is so important to our family and it's not just for sports. It's so that she um, is not discriminated against um, because of her identity. Trust me when I say there is nothing heroic about taking your young child and putting those thoughts in their head. I don't care what their sexuality is. There is no place to be talking about that with little kids. And it's the same thing with schools. Why on earth do some of these teachers in elementary school want to indoctrinate kids? These are not topics for elementary students. So when they talk about it in schools, you know that there's an agenda behind it and they're not just doing it to include everybody like they say they are. Little children don't even understand that much about these topics in the first place. Why are we going to them for their input? Oh, because the parents are telling them exactly what to say. Right, I forgot, my bad. Why don't we just let kids be kids? Let them have fun, let them experience their childhood, and not shove ideas down their throats.